welcome back to my channel. I'm glad you're here. And if you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you'll be notified for when I post new videos. And let's get on into the video. So my travels are finally starting to pick up again. I felt like I hadn't traveled forever. <laughs> you guys probably know that feeling when you just don't have like a super big trip planned and you're just like, okay, when is it coming? When is it coming? It's finally here. Up, but I'm going to Mexico. We're going to the Cancun region of Mexico. And we the reason why we're doing that is because I really wanted to start seeing all the seven wonders of the world. And I've been to Mexico so many times and I still have not seen Chichen Itza, which is crazy to me. So once I got out of school, I told Jamie, I want to start seeing the wonders of the world. Let's start with the closest one, which is Chichen Itza in Mexico. So we're just going for the week and we're also going to do some other fun stuff but in today's video I'm going to show you guys what I'm packing you guys seem to like these kind of videos where I show you kind of like each clothing item what I'm planning to pack that kind of stuff so that's what I'm going to do in this video and let's get on into it so the first thing we're going to talk about is bathing suits which is like a necessity for Mexico these are the bathing suits that I'm bringing maybe hopefully most likely I go back and forth, but I'm pretty sure these are the ones that I'm bringing. So first off, I have this. This is a one piece. It's a halter top. It has a, like a circle in the middle. In the back, it claps like that. Super cute, super classic. And then also going with that theme, I have two other classic bathing suits. Okay, so this is the back of it. I don't know if you guys can tell very well, but it's crisscrossed in the back and in the front. It is just like a regular, really sleek black bathing suit, which I think every girl needs one of because it just looks so classic and really slims you down. And then I also have this bathing suit, which is striped. It has like the crisscross in the front and in the back it has a low back. Kind of sexy, but super cute. And then I also have my high-waisted bottoms, which I love. I get asked all the time where these are from. Um, these were actually my mom's way back in the day, and she just like never wore them. So she's like, "Hey, like, do you want these? They fit me. They fit you better than they fit me." So I took them, and they have a little bow in the front, and they pretty much go with every bathing suit top. And then I think I've I've had this bathing suit for a while, so you guys might have seen it. But this is just like a tie-dyed high neck bathing suit, and in the back it has like an open back. And then I also have this top too to go with those bottoms. Um, it's like a palm tree high neck. Let's get on into the clothing. But I have this top which is like off the shoulder and has these pom poms on the bottom. I thought it was so cute with like high waisted jeans. Perfect for like being on the beach and eating on the beach and stuff. So I, I love this. And then my next thing is also off the shoulder. That's going to be a theme in this by the way. And this is a romper. It's like a black checkered with a bow in the top and little ruffles. Very cute and I plan to bring these with wedges. And then I always, always, always bring a regular black tank top because you just never know when you're going to need it. I also always, 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 and I'm sure you guys have seen this before in like many videos, this black and white little dress. It's super comfortable. Sometimes you just like need something to throw on for like if you're going to lunch, if you're going down the pool, you know, that kind of stuff. I have my high-waisted jeans that I wear all the time. These are pretty much the only pair that I own. I have my Nike shorts that I wear for like excursions, if we go work out or, you know, anything like that. I have this black and white uh, dress, like a tank top dress, and it's, it's midi, so it goes down to like right below my knees. And I'll, you know, this is really great for wearing for excursions because you can just like put it over a bathing suit really really easily and then I have two bathing suits cover-ups um, this is from TJ Maxx which is great I love TJ Maxx it's this one I don't know if that like really comes across on camera but it has a little hood on the back of it and it's just white and it's like knitted I guess and then I have this dress, which I'm super excited to wear this dress because I think it's so cute. It's off the shoulder, again. It's this off the shoulder dress. It's black with these beautiful sleeves with like the detailing. I just love the detailing of this dress. 
and I'll probably wear those with my wedges, which I'll show you guys in a second. I'm also bringing my ball cap. These are all my undies and socks. And I also have another bag for like a couple bras. This is my toiletry bag and I can fit all my toiletries in this plus other things like medications. I'm also stuffing this into my suitcase. This is my Fjall Raven Konkin backpack. I have a review of this if you want to see it. So as for the shoes that I'm going to be wearing, I have these wedges. These are the most comfy wedge I've ever had. I have my flats. I don't know what you'd call them, like gladiator or Jesus sandals. I'm not sure. Got these at DSW, extremely comfortable. And without a doubt, I always, always, always bring my Nike tennis shoes because these are like my favorite ever. I always wear them on the plane. It's super easy to get off and on. And then I'm also just bringing a regular player, a regular pair of flip flops just to go to the beach and stuff. I'm only really bringing two accessories because I'm not really an accessory girl. I think it's kind of silly to bring a bunch of stuff on a trip, to be honest. So I only bring like essential stuff. I have this necklace. Um, I'll try to get a close up for you guys. And then I just have my crossbody purse that I wear all the time. Um, I've had this for years. My mom got it for me and I just love it because it has two compartments. And then it also has a middle compartment that I usually stick my phone in. So yeah, I love this. So yeah, this is what I'm bringing, and all of this stuff will fit inside my carry-on size luggage. I've showed this in the past before, so I'm super, super excited, and if you guys haven't already, definitely go check out my Instagram. I'll be posting pictures, I'm sure, all week and for weeks to come afterward, and also I just got engaged if you haven't seen my last video. So there's also going to be wedding stuff coming up on my Instagram and also hopefully on this channel too if it, I ever decide to do that. But yeah, this is what I'm bringing to Mexico. I'm super excited and I hope you guys like this video. Give it a big thumbs up and tell me when your next trip is and I'll see you next video. Bye and happy travels.